Hi guys, in this video we're going to discuss detecting radiation, activity, and then we'll finish with a summary. So let's start by talking about how we detect radiation. We want to know how much radiation a radioactive sample is producing. Now, of course, if we have a sample with more radioactive atoms, then it's going to produce more radiation. But we also want to know how quickly the radiation is being produced. For example, if we have a sample like this, we know that eventually, given enough time, all of these unstable atoms will decay. But some samples and some unstable atoms might actually decay quicker than others. So the sort of quantity that we might be interested in would be something like how many decays occur per second. We can use a Geiger-Muller tube with a counter to record the number of counts of radiation reaching it in one second. So here we've got some radioactive sample. It emits a bit of radiation, which is then detected by this GM or Geiger-Muller tube. And then the number of counts per second is displayed on the screen. Now this isn't the only way to see how much radiation a sample is giving out. Photographic films can also be used to detect radiation. So here we've got a photographic film and the part which is sensitive ra to radiation is this light sensitive part here. Now we can use these photographic films to detect radiation because the more radiation a film is exposed to, the darker it becomes. So let's imagine our film here is struck by some radiation. As a result, the film becomes darker. So by seeing how dark the film has got, we can see how much radiation is being emitted towards it. Now let's be more precise and introduce the concept of activity. We know that this GM or Geiger-Müller tube measures the number of counts of radiation per second. So again, here is our GM tube and here is our sample, which is emitting a count of radiation. Hey guys, to continue watching this video, and unlock hundreds of other super concise and exam board specific GCSE physics and combined science videos. Just click on the snap revised smiley face. Join me today and let's make physics at GCSE a walk in the park.